from our newest vlog and so, you couldn't have your rice crispy treats i'm all out of rice crispy treats so i had some uh, cheesecake that we had left over from jay cooked, jay for, cooked us. for us so and val wants to go out do something which is very unusual we got to try and figure out what to do yeah but, i don't want to just go to the grocery store or anything like that i want to go somewhere and it's got to be something that costs no money because yeah that's what we have no. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Good morning, everybody. I didn't sleep well again last night. I didn't go to bed till like 6 o'clock in the morning. <coughs> it was the, uh, the vlogs, for some reason, seem to be taking longer again. I need air, big time air, because it's hot out here. It feels great. I love it. What are you nuts? I should mow the lawn. You mean the jungle we have in our yard? Yeah. We have a gas can. Yeah, I gotta get gas. Oh, we gotta go back to the house. We forgot the, the night shirt for Walmart. Okay. We had a fun trip. Two cars. Are you giving me dirty looks? Are you giving me dirty looks? All right, that was a great trip. Yay, I got out of the house. <laughs> now we're going back home. So we made it to the end of the road and had to come back because I have to exchange the night shirt for a larger size so it goes over my arm when I have my surgery. And we're going to get the gas can because if Kevin has a little bit of energy later, he may mow the uh, jungle we have going on out here. Okay, that's the temperature here right now. This is crazy. It's March. This is not right. This is not right. This is too hot. Here he comes. Here he comes. Look at that. It's too hot. Let's heat this place up a little more. 88. That's nice. It's hot. Too hot. Too hot. Okay, everybody. I just went to Kohl's and spent my Kohl's gift card that I got from Brian for my birthday. And it's for something that keeps her from burning herself. <laughs> it's silicone. What are they called? Uh, it's just splatter, splatter guards. Splatter guards. Splatter guards. So when I'm cooking in the kitchen and I'm cooking the chicken and stuff in oil... I can put this over the pan so it doesn't splatter all over the place. And it's so it doesn't make my stove all oily. Not so I don't burn myself <laughs> on him. Right. Then we went to the post office because I had to mail out a package. I'm getting hungry. What? Where are we going to eat? Uh, someplace with food. We can get some Cupid's tacos. No. No Cupid's tacos? No. That place does not look too... Um, How about the silver rated. dollar pancake house? I hear that place is really good. What do you feel like eating? I don't know. So this is the main drag going down Corona. This is Main Street. 
Actually, this is not Main Street. This is 6th Street. This is 6th Street. Told you we were on 6th Street. What of are you course, talking Terry. about? Of course, Terry. <laughs> chuck wagon. The we chuck can go wagon. to the chuck wagon. <laughs> you can have cocktails while we're there. Oh, well, let's go have some cocktails. That's what I need, some cocktails. That's right. That's what we both need. <laughs> Vlog ain't going up tonight. I could use a couple of Bloody Marys. <laughs> we just pla passed a uh, funeral and crematorium place. Let's go eat there. <laughs> Brains! <laughs> I think they'd appreciate that. <laughs> okay. It's a beautiful day. Yes, it is. It's a very nice day, except it's too hot. You're in an air conditioned car. So, yes, I know. So I'm uh, chill. I'm in. I'm in chilled. Chilled. Chill. I am chilled. Thank you. Look at the freeway. See all those cars up there on that little that bridge that are like stop. That's the freeway. And we wanted to go someplace, and now we're not going to go someplace. It's, everybody's decided to go someplace today. Yeah, it's a nice day, so everybody is going somewhere. So we're just going to go, like we did, to Kohl's and to the post office and to get something to eat and to Walmart and then home. Yes, dear. All right, this vlog's getting too long. Okay, I gotta stop now because he, he says it's getting too long. Look at up there on the mountain though, isn't that pretty? Oh my god. Look at, what I'm is cutting, that? I'm cutting this all out now. What is that up there? Go to Angel's. I hear they have some good food. You just want to see the topless waitresses. No! So what'd you get to eat? Chibaga. On a pretzel bun? Three up. Huh? Three O's. Rios? Rios. Rios. Is that the name of the bun? You got some fries, and I got a grilled chicken on an Asiago. Mm hmm. <laughs> One napkin. <laughs> Saving that for later. Saving it for Boomer? Yeah. <laughs> Hi, everybody! What, do I it's have? time for our community shout outs! Do I have to keep poking you to get you to work? How about if I do this? Hey, don't there touch the go. cat ears. <laughs> Hi, everybody. It's time for Neighborhood Community Shoutouts. I know it's not Halloween, but I have a pumpkin shirt on because, well, I've it's some, always Halloween in our house. I have some Halloween shirts I've been dying to wear. But You've got Christmas pants on. He's got Snoopy I got Christmas sh trees That's on. only because nobody can see them. Snoopy. Anyhow... Frankie Laverne. I am very, very sorry. Frankie's not a boy. He's a girl. It's like Frankie She's and Johnny. Girl. Yeah. Sorry, Frankie. But y'all know me. I can't leave it wrong. I had to fix it. So, shout out to Frankie Laverne. She is awesome. Courtney Shepard. Welcome to the neighborhood. You know what one Blazing Eagle one said? What did he say? He said, it's okay if I don't feel up to doing shout outs. That he would be glad to wait to the Middle Earth and back for me to do them. Wow. Thank you, one Blazing Eagle one. I really appreciate that. Amanda Nichols. Thank you for the very kind words. And I am trying to log all my food that I eat because I'm trying really, really hard since I'm not on any medication to have a well-balanced meal. Each meal. <laughs> Try it. Tucker Zone! He gave, you were asking people for advice on how to, for Valerie not to burn herself, not to do to fix the burns. Advice for Val not burning herself again. Kevin, do all the cooking. I want to eat something more than top ramen. Yeah, that'll be a real boring uh, <laughs> uh, nibbling with the neighbors watching me do my thing. Go ahead. 
Timmy Alexander. Welcome to, to the neighborhood. neighborhood. You said one. No, I didn't. <laughs> G Moore, 1985, and Terry Johnson, and the Spasmodic. All three of them got Kevin, Kevin's impression yesterday. It's from the Red Green Show, but the spasmodic went even a little bit further. Yeah, if the women don't find you handsome, they should at least find you handy. So, if any of you don't know what that is, it's a Canadian show. It's the Red Green Show. It was awesome, though, guys. If you can find an episode of Red Green Show, you should watch it. Um, and Pierre Herrera wants to know about Mama Kitty. Well, it's a long story about Mama Kitty. She's out upstairs all the time playing with Ebony. Megan's up there. She's out with Megan upstairs. Don't try and approach her. No, no, no. But if I go up the stairs, Oof. she's gone. She's gone. For some reason, that cat does not want anything to do with me. Or me. Or Kevin. Fine upstairs with Megan, with Megan's boyfriend, Brian. Boomer gave us a good scare the other night. A little sneaker got out and scared the crap out of us. I almost was crying. And then we couldn't find Mama or Mojo. So I was panicking, thinking they all got out. It's time for Neighborhood Community Credit Roll. And I didn't give Kevin my book today. No, she only gave me a piece of paper. That's right. I only get a piece of... Boy, people seem to be angry at me at this one. <laughs> boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Was Kevin pulling a fast one? Huh, huh, huh? <laughs> Apparently so. It was kind of a trick question, but not really. Not um, meant to be. When the movie came out, as you remember, it had a twist ending. And he was very clever not to make let anybody know uh, how, the, how the ending was oh. going to go. And so, uh, you all only see Anthony Perkins dressed as mom at the very end. And you can tell that he, he looks really awful in a dress. He has huge shoulders. The guy's like 6'3". His face is a big, big, horsey, long face. There's no way they could have put him in the shower scene without you knowing, oh, that's just Norman. So they have, they had two people playing her, plus uh, three more people. Um, as the voice. As the voice. Uh, one person, G. Moore, got four of them. Uh, got the four feet of the voices. Virginia Gray, Paul Jasmine, Jeanette Nolan. And he also got Ann Dorr, who was the woman who was actually doing the stabbing. <laughs> but Margot Eppers was also played uh, the mother. When you saw long shots, when you see her walking back and forth in her bedroom window, that's Margot Eppers. And when she first walked and uh, snuck into the bathroom, that was Margot Eppers. And then, of course, Anthony Perkins played his mom. So that's a total of, what, six people who played uh, Played and or mom. voice up. Uh, the first one to get three of the answers was Terry Johnson and then Greg Myers. G. Moore got four of the, s well, I'm going to have to say four of the, of the five. six. And G. Moore got five of the six. Bubba the Love Sponge got three, and um, Christy Shiver. Christy Shiver um, got um, four. Uh, three. 1962 uh, movie Carnival of Souls. Uh, I only have one simple question for that one. What and where was the uh, abandoned carnival that's so prominent? So there you have it, guys your trivia question for tonight. You are all part of our neighborhood community, each and every one of you out there. We love you all so very much. Thank you for following along with us every single night, even though he's driving everybody insane. <laughs> Thumbs up. Thank you for following along. Make sure to go by and check out the hey, neighborhood. Hey, hey, hey. Mojo! She's sharpening her, nail, her nails on our, our leather couch. Um, <laughs> Thumbs up, make sure you go following al follow along at the Neighborhood Zoo, Paranormal Investigations with the Neighbors, PIN, Megan's Arts and Crafts, and we will catch you guys all tomorrow. Bye! Bye!